Hello out there and welcome to English Teacher Plays. We're here with Cat Interstellar, which is in early access. Please report to departures. Okay. Um uh, yeah, we're good. Uh so this is an early access. I think I please report to departures. I bought it on uh Ooh, I'm an Android. Cool. Um I bought it on Humble Bundle. On the humble store because it was like a dollar or something or fifty cents. Huh. Okay, so they just have the they have the one line of dialogue. It'd be cool if they stopped talking and did some other stuff, but that's fine. I'm supposed to report to departure, so we're going. So, um, yeah, I picked this up for like 50 cents. It's cool. I thought I might show you guys. Um, <laughs> it's just turtles all the way down. Nice. Love that. It's turtles all the way down. Oh, here we go. Welcome to departures. Please select your destination. Okay, like, um, that's cool. I love the outside out here. It looks awesome. Welcome to departures. Please select speech your bubbles, subtitles. Okay, let's go to level one, I guess. Look at that thing. Look at that little thing. It's like whoop 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 whoop. Ammonia infusion facility, one kilometer beneath Martian surface, Mars. Okay. Looks like she's coming online. Get the stutter assembler ready. We need to get her sensor attached before the power goes out again. Uh, okay. Activating sensor. Internal diagnostics coming online. Navigation protocols active. Dog, can you move? Ha! Ah, look at this! Everything's working, dog. Android 521 succeeds in the laboratory. It's out these doors to the left. He'll explain all the details to you. I'm a dog! Good luck out there, dog. Bark, bark, bark. Bark, bark, bark. Good luck out there, dog. Bark, 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 bark. Bark, 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 bark! I'm a dog. Ooh, which way do we go? It said out these doors to the left. Oh, these are the doors over here, I see. I want to go to the right, though. Nope, that does nothing. Okay. Nope. All right. Oh. Nope. Can't go in there. Okay. Let's go for a run. Oh, what's going on in here? That place looks worse than here. Yeah, besides the radiation, it probably is. That place looks worse than here. Yeah, besides the okay, radiation. Right. So what happens if this whole terraforming thing doesn't work? Apparently, the humans built some kind of machine to melt the ice. I think they might be worried that won't work either. Right, so, oh, I can move that. Look at that. Just, just bashing stuff up. Oh, I can jump as well. Nice. On your head. Boing. Okay. Yep. All right. Well, let's get out of here, I guess. Oh, what's going on there? What? What is this? Damn, the reducer failed again. I guess that fix we put in last week didn't work. This whole planet is falling apart. Right. So there's lots of broken stuff. We can go in this way. That was downstairs. Uh, let's go this way. Nah. Let's go downstairs. There's lots of stuff to go and look at. Ooh. Where are we going, though? Ooh. Found the server room. Okay. Okay. We're just doing a little bit of exploring. Right. Oh, there's another door. Uh, him, dog. All of our more human personalities came from social media portfolios. There's literally a human somewhere on Earth in Android 38's exact sense of humor. <laughs> I love it. Don't mind him, dog. I love it. So the uh, so all the Android personalities came from social media per profiles. I love it. Right. I got an achievement for going to the server room as well. I guess we weren't supposed to do that. Uh, no, that's where I just came from. Let's go this way. 
Love getting them Chivos. What's going on? What's going on up here? Oh, nope. This is just a hallway for no reason, okay? Right. Hey, dog. It's incredible how much we've changed this planet. I wonder if it's possible to All change. All the drones are in position. The ignition process will start the soon. aren't just used for orbital supply lines. The tethers operate like a drill during its planetary descent. Okay. Once we get the coordinated again, the humans will be able to colonize without worrying about radiation. Okay. Right. They need to see in the lab before you leave. In the lab. Hey, dog. Glad to see you up and running. Hopefully you can get in and out of the mine before this whole place falls apart. I hope so. I don't know where the lab is, though. Uh, okay. Oh, anything up there? No. Okay. Maybe this is the lab. Oh. There's a tree. Ha, <laughs> cool. Okay, I have no idea which way to go. We are exploring. Move it, dog. Excuse me, dog. Excuse me, dog. Right. I like this place feels like alive, even though it's all full of robots. It feels alive, you know, like there's stuff happening. Believe the first extraterrestrial life was found by a couple spelunkers on a Martian vacation. I guess space tourism actually did pay off. Ah, I guess it did. Is this the lab? It's good to see you firing on all cylinders, dog. Obviously, that is just a metaphor. I did not mean to imply that your engine was still a simple combustion engine. Some of the androids around here will trade their brain for that T6 fusion driver you're running on. Sorry, I'm a little off subject. The reason we commissioned them was to locate some drones that went missing in the lower caverns. Unfortunately, we lost communication with them a few days ago when the quakes got really bad. We aren't concerned with the drones themselves. We just need you to download their data points. The glowing bacteria, as unique as it is, simply cannot be the only form of life in this entire planet. We've never been this deep in the planet's core, so we've been sending drones now in the hopes of finding something that previously evaded us. I do not know how long it will be safe to be down there. It's very important that you cover at least a few data points. You need to know if you're down Oh, and before I forget, I had the maintenance crew modify your sensor. The drones are powered by a specific plutonium isotope, which your sensor can detect. Pardon the pun, but it should allow you to sniff them out. I'll turn it on for you. You should see some smudges from the drones in this room. All right, dog, make your way to the mine. Meet up with Android 42. If you find any of the drones, make sure you secure their data logs. Okay. We've got our mission. So, there's a lot to this already. I'm, uh, I'm enjoying myself. Why is that guy running, though? I'm curious. Where are you running, man? Where are you off to? You're just jogging. I'm gonna chase you down. I'm gonna catch you. Move it, dog. Excuse me, dog. Uh, it's those guys. They just sort of walk around in circles. I see. Oh, I can double jump? Oh, dude, I can double jump. Legit. Boing, boing. Gotta love that double jump. Hey, dog. Glad to see you up and running. All hey. Down the hall to the right. All right. Damn, something's jammed the door. Maybe your grappling can get it open. Uh... Maybe it can. Or just tear the whole thing down. There we go. <laughs> I mean, that works, right? Awesome. There we go. Now the door is open. I didn't know I could do that. Oh, it doesn't work on everything. I see. Tram collapsed again. This is not good. You're gonna have to take the elevator. Okay. I'll do that. Dog, 
You need to take the elevator to the surface. Just activate the console on the inside. All right, but first I want to go look at the train. These earthquakes get worse every time the skylift descends. I guess it's to be expected when you're trying to reignite the core of a planet. I guess it is to be expected. What's this guy got to say? I don't know. Let's see. End of the road. I found. I got another achievement. It's the Mako. Nice. Double jump. That's right. That's how we do. All right. And we're off to the surface to do some exploration. Bum, 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 bum. This is, uh, oh, is this Mars? Right, so this is well worth the 50 cents or whatever I paid for it on Humble Store. So if you're looking for a game, you can pick this up. Well, didn't know they had a dog up and running. That brings you to the surface. The train didn't collapse again, did it? Ah, uh, knew that was gonna happen. Ha! <laughs> Rude. Can you believe they have an engineer class android working on the air ducts? I wish we had a little more say in the job we got around here. Yep. What do you... How are the air ducts looking? The humans are gonna want to move in once we get the solar radiation under control. We need to be ready. That's true. We do need to be ready. Humans are, are nasty and gross. Oop. Oof, oof, oof. Alright, let's go. These Mars quakes are getting worse and worse. The Mars quakes. Oh, right, because they're not earthquakes. How's it going, dog? I'm, I'm good, man. I'm just chilling. This seems like the right way, so we're going to go the wrong way and get some more exploration going. dun da da, -da. Sorry, dog. I'm kind of busy. Don't they need you in the mine? Oh, hey, Doug. I'm just trying to stabilize some of the uplinks with Earth. And if you look out the window, you can see Android 536 in the tipping. Cool. This is rad. Grab a screeny there. Grab a screeny there. And then we'll head down the we'll head down the way. Meow. Oh, hey, Doug. Let me get these blast doors open. Thanks, man. Time. I know they need some help over at the greenhouse. Just head out these doors to the right. Okay. Thanks, man. First, let's go talk to this guy. Just trying to make a connection with Earth. Is it working? I guess not. We'll head out these doors to the right. Because that's what he said. He said go up to the greenhouse. Did you see the ship? The fertilizer's already... Okay. Whatever that was supposed to be about. Who it is? Hope you're enjoying your Martian vacation. I sort of am. What's that? What's back here? Nothing. Just flying around. So is this the way to the greenhouse? I like the uh, lack of a map, actually. You know that the the people just sort of give you uh, directions. This is cool, man. Cat Interstellar. Ooh, I wonder. I wonder how, um, like breakable the the map parts are. Oh, they are exceedingly breakable. Like to the point where I could probably climb wherever I wanted to go. Rad. Oh, I want. And it's relatively easy to get unstuck as well. So that is cool. Explore. I got Explorer. Nice. I got another achievement. And it's not just random garbage achievements, it's an actual achievement, so that's cool. Doug, I just got a shipment of fertilizer. Could you grab some and put it in the machine? Sure, man. Where is it? Doug, we just got a shipment of fertilizer. Could you grab some and put it in the machine? Okay. Where, where do I get it from, man? Where's the fertilizer? I don't see any. I don't see it. The solar panel. Where is the fertilizer? Nope, I can't see any fertilizer anywhere, team. We just got a shipment of fertilizer. Can you grab some and put it in the machine? This must be the fertilizer here. Let's try this.
Oh. There we go, we did it. True that. So was that Is that everything? Is that all is that what I was doing here? Can we go inside now? No. Okay, well, we uh we helped out at the greenhouse. So now we're now we're on onward. Onward and upward, I guess. I'm curious as to what's this way. There's like a big space elevator thing there. I'm wondering what it is. Is that where I came from? Must be. Overlook. Oh wow, I found the uh, solar panel array. Cool. That's rad. Hey, there's, a, um, there's an android out here. Let's go talk to him. See what he's up to. What's up, man? Hard to believe we're still maintaining pet projects like this. This solar array has to be constantly maintained. Provides a fraction of the power our fusion reactors do. Huh. Interesting. We're supposed to go find the mine, though. Of course, I don't know. That looks like the mine there. Nicely found, team. Nicely found. And there's an android. I know you were anxious to get into the mine, but we need your help here on the surface. Angel 58 has been requesting assistance in the skylift since the storm. You can spot the skylift from anywhere. Just look up. Okay. It wants me to head over to the skylift. I can do that. So we're doing some quests. And we're just doing it out of the kindness of our hearts. I like that there's no, like, damage either. We're just sort of going around. We're doing stuff. We're helping out. We're cat, and we're interstellar. Man, I feel so free. Like, as long as there's stuff to do, like it, like the exploration so far has been quite rewarding. I'm getting ex, uh, ex uh, not XP, achievements and stuff for doing the exploring. That's really cool. Dog, I'm glad you showed up. I need some help. Okay. The sensor here is working. A storm blew away mm -hmm. a crate containing some plutonium rods. Could you try to track it down and put it in the skylift? Okay. Yep. There we go. Tracking, tracking. Oh. Nope. There we go. We were going the wrong way. Yep. Yeah. There we go. And this way. Oh. And keep on going this way. And which way now? There we go. Found jet. And some more up here. We've got some nice wind effect there over the sand, which is pretty cool. Yeah, this game is rad. This is really cool. I'm having fun. I'm very pleased with my 50 cents purchase. Um, I mean, is that it there? Can I just fly straight there? I think I might be able to. We can speed this along. This is it, right? Must be. Okay, let's take this back. Load box and skylift, 108 meters. Oh, we can't. No, we gotta just go back the way we came. That's fine. There we go. We found it for you, man. We are super helpful. I wonder what happens if we jump down the hole. I am very curious. Top of the stairs, huh? Right. Okay. I've been getting a number of messages while you were working. Apparently, they're pretty anxious to get you in the mine. Just head towards the sun. Once you get past the rock outcropping, you'll see the entrance on your left. Okay. I'm on the way. Boosh. Boosh, boosh. Time to go get in the mine. Over the rocks. 
Over the rocks and through the woods to Grandma's house we go. On our way up, there's some stuff. Yeah, I like that it's like I feel like I could go over to that mountain. I could just go wherever, but I'm gonna I am gonna go where they said. Thanks for helping out, dog. Be careful down there. Okay. Let's go enjoy the meat and potatoes now. Time to go be a cat. Cat, cat, cat. Because that is what we do. Chapter 3. The Mind. It's Android 42. I got it. That's another achievement that you can't see. Sorry. Dog, you made it. I'm Android 42. Sup? Before we go down to the caves, I could really use your help with something. It shouldn't take too long. Just follow me. Okay, let's go. Dun, 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 dun. Whoa, did you just break everything again? Android 1's gonna be pissed. Real funny, 42. I see you found someone to go in the caves with you. I hope you know what you're getting into, dog. Be careful down there, 42. Why does that one have eyes? Better. We'll be fine. These dog units are built for this. In and out. That's the plan. That one has really weird, creepy eyes. Well, welcome to the mine. This is where the Skylift is anchored into the planet. I'm not sure if Android 520 went over this in the mission briefing, but the tether acts like a drill during its descent. Uh, I feel like all we do is inventory. Well, you can volunteer to work in the mine if you want. I think we have it pretty good. There's a highly unstable fusion reactor near the bottom that'll melt whatever it touches. It uses the force of the descent to push it deeper into the planet's core. We can uh. show how fast it burns by siphoning some of that energy back up through the tether into four distributors. It usually isn't a problem, but the last quake caused so much damage, we had to take them offline. Okay. Looks like a break in one of the inner fibers. It's always the inner fiber. Haha. Uh -huh. Right. I've already rebooted their systems remotely, but they need to be powered on manually. You can do this by activating the console connected to them. Okay. The other three aren't as easy as this one. One of the bridges got knocked out, so your double thrust will come in handy. You might also have to clear a few rocks to get to the last one. Okay. Easy peasy. Well, how do I... Okay. Um, okay, well, I don't actually know where I'm supposed to be going. He said, if you need help finding the consoles, follow the cables. And I'm like, okay. That looks dangerous. Can we get up on top? What's over here? Oh, we can go down here. Who left the light out there? I have no idea. I have no idea. Right, okay, so there's like a waterfall. Lies Island. Okay, I found an island. Cool. Well, oh, I found a console. Good job, me. All right. And we're across. Nice. Nailed it. Set up there. Alright, we're just gonna go have a look. Like I said, the uh, the exploration feels like worthwhile in this game, which is cool. You know, you get little achievements and stuff. In this instance, there's nothing up here. That's fine. That doesn't mean that exploring is useless, it just means I found one useless place. Probably, if they thought someone was gonna go up there, they would have put an achievement in or something. Um, Cause that's been the that's been the mo so far. Cool, look at that thing. That's rad. Okay, let's just go. Let's go up this rock face. Cause that's fun. Let's see what's over here. Um, I don't think we're supposed to be over here. 
my my general feeling here is that we're we've gone well outside the scope of what we were supposed to do. But that's fine. Oh, there's the console. We can't quite get to it. Nope, we can't get to it. Okay, we're gonna have to go back around. I wonder. Yes! Uh, no, 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 no! Oh, I made it! I, I had it made. Oh my god, no, we're definitely gonna fall down. I wonder what happens. Oh, what happened? Oh, we just reappear here. Okay. Lucky. Hey, that was really fast as well. Lots of these games, they take, they take ages to uh, restart you. And that's really frustrating. It's like, hey man, I want to play the game, not watch a loading screen. That happened basically instantaneously without like yelling at me for dying and stuff. So that's cool. Okay, so I'm gonna stop, stop screwing around. Um, although it was fun. I mean, we can just we can just fly over to the the console here. All right. There we go. Come on back over. Okay. I wonder if we can take a shortcut here. Yep, we can. And we're over. We're back. That doesn't look good. Oh dear. We uh we got exploded in. Chapter 4, The Caves, Location Unknown, Attitude, Altitude Unknown. Uh-oh. SpaghettiOs. Uh, okay. Alright, so we're in some caves now. Nice. Nope. Where's my android? Dog, over here. Can what? you help me out? Dog, over here. Can you help me out? Yep, I can, man. Thanks a lot, I. Holy Christ. Look at Android 388. Alright, mission's over. We need to figure out how to get out of here. I'll let you take the lead. If you can't find a way out, maybe you can make one. Okay, man. Let's, um, let's do it. There we go. Can you come in through? Well, yes. That's one way to make a path. Yeah, I'm awesome, dude. I'm so awesome. Is this that what I think it is? Oh. Where are we going? What's over here? self burrowing cables. They connect the skylights together. We just need to keep following them. I'll let you lead the way. Okay, so we just follow the cables. Nope. That way. Um. Nope, that's not that's not doing us any good. Okay. Right. So we gotta follow these cables. Nope. Um. What about this way? Nope. All right, well, let's go this way. Yep, there we go. Take care of the, take care of all that. There we go. You coming? There we go. Now you can come along. All right, let's go, man. Let's go do some exploration. Hey! No anomalies found. No Is that one of the drones? Anomalies found. No anomalies found. No anomalies found. Let me take a look at his data log. Yeah, man, take a look. Transferring data log. Transfer complete. Looks like its main generator died about two days ago. It's just been laying here in emergency mode since then. I know these drones aren't sentient, but I'm gonna shut it down anyway. 
The idea of staring at a rock until you die is a little terrifying. Shutting down. Gross. Let's keep moving. Yep, let's go. Listen, dog. I don't want to freak you out or anything, but if we have a cave in and it doesn't kill us, we're gonna sit in a rock coffin until our batteries die, just like that drone back there. Uh, I don't want to freak you out, but here's a terrifying scenario. Enjoy. I mean, these caves look pretty established. Doesn't seem like it. have a suicide switch anymore thanks to those hippies back on Earth and their pro-consciousness movement. All right. I like that. Some world, some casual world building. I mean, I appreciate the right to unmanipulated thought, but sometimes it's just easier to restart. Ha. Uh, I mean, you're probably right. This is cool, man. This is awesome. I mean, we're 31 minutes in, and I'm like really, I'm well, loving this. I guess sometimes you gotta go down to go up. I guess sometimes you do. Yeah, I guess we're going down. Down. You coming? I mean, I guess. You have to do that. Let's go see what's behind here. Nada. Nada mucho. Doing some exploring in the cave. So this is a little bit more linear than up top, but that's okay. We need to keep moving. These caves obviously aren't safe. That's true. It does seem... Good thing there's natural pathways to What's this way? I mean... Okay. Oh, there's a... Something going this way. Is this where we just came from? I think it is. I want to go through this though. All right, what's in here? Nothing. Nothing is in here. Okay. Nothing. Just a just a wall that we can go through. Okay. Oh, I found a thing. Follow that. Which way is it going, though? Oh, there was one? No. Alright, you found another one. It sounds like this one didn't find anything no. either. Uh -huh. But I'll check it again. You do that, and I'll take out these. Shutting down. At this point, I really don't care if they found anything. I just want to get out of here. But we've got our mission to do, man. Yes. What is that? Well, this one picked a weird spot to crash. That is super weird. Sounds like it's completely fried. Not sure how that could have happened. You know, I've never seen hanging tubes like this outside of a lab. Yeah, super weird. That's okay. I actually don't know where we are now. We're just sort of wandering. Cool. Okay. So where are we now? I can't imagine what it must be like for these drones. Wandering past all this. Aren't aren't we drones, man? Like, isn't that But I guess we're sentient, that's the idea. Okay. I actually have no idea which way we're supposed to go. Can't go through that way. Nope, can't go through that way. Let's go around. 
Nope, nothing that way. Okay. Oh, there's something that looks like. What the hell? Whoa. Rad. So rad. Uh, okay, we gotta keep moving. I'll get some recordings. Yeah, man. Okay, Why this. This is cool. I wonder how old this is. Well, let's go have a look at the bottom. Some of the statues have symbols on them. Yeah. I don't know if we can make anything from the symbols, but we could probably infer a lot from the statues. I mean, they obviously had a head. They aren't like spiders or anything. Yeah. That's cool, man. That's so weird. So Well there's like hands. Oh girl, that's gross. There's a couple of hands. Yep. Okay, officially devolved into creepiness. Uh nope, I figured it out. We're past it. I shot it down. Yeah, no anomalies, my ass. Why didn't they find this? <laughs> yeah, no anomalies, my I do. But we, we sort of already found these tubes before. Ooh. Oh, man, this is really messing with my head. Gross. This looks like an incubation chamber for the bacteria. Whoever made those statues must have made this too. Right, yeah. Let's keep going, though. That's true. Oh, what's that there? Yep, can't go through. It's like oh, they're using the tunnels to transport different types of bacteria. This is a machine. Where are ya? Uh. That doesn't sound good. We need to get out of here. Okay, let's go, man. You lead the way. Follow me. I'm following you, dude. Come on, dog. That's me. I'm a dog. Oh, no. Ooh, that was a close one. Jesus. Where'd he go? Oh, he's, like, straight up leaving me behind. Definitely does not care about his dog very much. I'm coming. I'm just... I'm over top of you. Wow, it's filled with, like... can't stop. That's cool. This is so cool. I'm, uh, I love it. I'm loving this. Like, seriously loving it. Oh! Is that, is that game over? <laughs> Meow Interstellar, chapter five signals. Wait, what? Oh, I'm, I'm a cat. No. <laughs> I'm a cat. Meow. I'm, I'm straight up a cat. Oh, dude. <laughs> I can meow. Oh, dude. Oh. Okay, well, I mean, if you weren't going to get this game before, uh, you definitely should now. Overriding timer. Activating icebreaker. 
please evacuate the facility immediately. <laughs> Initiation cannot be stopped at this point. Please evacuate 200 miles to the south. Do not head west. Oh. Do not head west. Opening all exhaust vents. Oh, okay. So where do I need to go then? I'm I'm a cat. And I, I would quite like to not die, but I don't, I don't know how to do that. Oh, this way. There's a light. Opening all the exhaust vents. Go, kitty, go! <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> I'm just like... <laughs> Initializing melting process. What does that mean? What's going on? Okay. So they've melted. Right? We don't want to get wet because we're a cat. Oh, what's that over there? I don't, I don't know what's going on over here. Okay, well, it's the wrong way to go, but that's fine. I was just doing a little exploring. The kitty is not very qu is not very quick. That's uh, one of the only problems. Mixing dye. Mixing dye. What is it doing? Man, this game just like did like a hard right turn. I have no idea what's going on, but that's fine. I'm, <laughs> I'm a kitty. Meow, meow. I'm a kitty. And now we're outside. That's the Statue of Liberty. Okay. And they're escaping, I guess. Oh my God. Ah. I'll just grab a grab a quick screeny of that. Kitty stare surveying the Statue of Liberty. Oh man. The end. The end what? What do you mean the end? What really? That's the end? That's that's all of it? Aww. It's just firing on all cylinders, dog. It's incredible how much we've changed. Oh but it's so short! It's only forty minutes. Aww. It's like set up so well. Man, I, I really Oh, I really wanted more. The ship's manifest says we're heading back to Earth, but I don't see that happening. You think they're gonna drop half a million fully sent anywhere in 42? Or even that dog unit he was with? Nothing yet. I'm about to go commandeer one of those low frequency scanners myself. Yeah. Okay. Thanks for playing. That's... Uh, it, it actually straight up exited me out. Okay, so we're uh, we're done with Cat Interstellar. That was Cat Interstellar. It's an early access. Um, wow. Let's go. Uh, let's go look at the description. I guess. Okay, Cat Interstellar, a short story inspired by Robert Heinlein's *The Moon Is a Harsh Mistress*. I really like Robert Heinlein. I didn't. I mean, I guess it's inspired by it. Um, so right now on Steam, it's $5.99, but like I said, you can get it from the Humble Store for 50 cents. 50 cents on the Humble Store, so pick it up if you want. Um, I didn't do all of the content. Play as a dog, six drone, a newly activated maintenance bot who is assisting in the terraforming effort on Mars. After a predictable yet unfortunate accident, dog finds herself uncovering the past of a seemingly barren planet. Okay. 
So, seriously, it started off promising with a premise about exploring on Mars and finding some really cool stuff on the ground, and then end suddenly. Yeah. Um, real experience we had here. Strong emotions, be warned. I mean, I mean, not really. I mean, I really like it, but I, yeah, I would, I would prefer that there was more content. I'm not, I'm not dollars per hour kind of guy. I'm definitely not that kind of guy, but I am like, there's like, it's so good. Do you know what I mean? The storytelling so good and the, the content is good and everything that you do feels worthwhile and you go exploring there's a reason for it and you find stuff and it's like whoa look at all this cool stuff and then you're a cat and then it goes away so i mean this is an early access so there's time for it to get better um it was released on the 7th of october last year so it's still being worked on great love it keep working on it make it better um Made by Ionized Games. Let's see if Ionized Games has made anything else. Uh, they made... What is the project files? Well, what is that? What is the project files? This contact requires a base game on Steam in order to play. Of a skeleton mesh, animation, textures, and control mechanics code. Next step is to add environmental assets of the Martian service. Along with more complicated blueprints to set lighting. Oh, okay. So, so people can like program stuff like you know in cat interstellar so they can make looks like um branching trees and stuff like if this then that yeah, it's pretty cool that's cool that they released that i like that um yeah so that's cat interstellar it's cool it's uh very short but that's fine early access i think there's a lot of promise here if this was like a four hour experience um i would say it was like a, a super well done game since it's only 40 minutes, I have to say it's too short. Just too short. But what's here is, like, so highly polished. It, the, the gameplay is fantastic. It's beautiful. The voice acting is on point. There's some good story. There's some good set pieces. It's, you know, everything's here. It's just, it's, it just needs more. It just needs more. So, I'm going to leave it there. Thanks for watching. That was Cat Interstellar, the whole thing that's available right now. And uh, I'll see you guys next time. Class dismissed.